Hi guys, it's me, Strawberry, and I'm back with another video. So today we're doing a little PG Babies voiceover. So as you can see, I got the I got about uh, I think five slimes, and I got two clay kits, and two clay kits, and some other slimes. And you are gonna see these clay kits. I got alien axolotl jelly, dragon's fire. Just the boba, teddy bear grams, and fresh fruit waffle. And I'm going to do a 100% honest review for all of these. And I apologize for the no background noises. There was a whole bunch. I apologize for no, the no audio. There was a lot of background noises. So, yes, these are all over the slimes. We're going to start off with Alien Axolotl Jelly. My brother wanted to help me review this one. At first, it was a little sticky, but then it started to get better. It, it has a smell at first. It smells like sour green apples. And then it kind of faded to a sweet smell. So, I apologize for him stretching it so far. It was very squishy, and I actually like their jelly textures the most. It was pretty amazing, and it was really sticky for my mom and my brother, but once I started playing with it, it got very much better. It made amazing crackles and bubble pops. If you like ASMR and like bubble pops and crackles, then I 100% recommend this slime. Next, we have Just the Boba. Now, this one, I actually have it right now, and I can't even touch it. It is so sticky. It does melt, so it was a little melted when it first came in. We had to add some activator, but um, I'm going to make some of my own activator and then activate it. It smells just like boba, and it actually looks like caviar, but it's... It's like the same thing, kind of, but not like the same thing in food, but okay, we're getting a little off track here. It's like, it looks exactly like caviar, and it made amazing bubble pops, however, was very tacky. We tried to reduce the tackiness by adding some uh, activator, but it just made it a little more rippy, so I was like, it's going to obviously be like that, because it has to be a little sticky for the beads to stay in. Next, we have Dragon's Fire. Now, this one smells really good. However, it has a really hard, like, really dark blue color and is very, like, sometimes it stains my hands whenever I play with it and it stains my table. So, there was just a lot of residue for this one. Now, I have it here and it's better. 100% better. I really like it. Um, yeah, so this is just us playing with it because I really liked the slime. And this was actually one of my first ever cloud doughs. Um, I think that's a cloud dough. I have no idea. But this was one of my first slimes, like this texture. And I really like it. Me and my brother and my mom made some fun little shapes with it. Very moldable and very stretchy, but it, it has like... It, it'll droop when you try to stretch it. Next, we have fresh fruit waffle. This smells exactly like fresh fruit waffles. And the base was super clicky, so I do recommend playing with the base before you add in the clay. This one was... It came with a waffle, some fruit charms, and some clear syrup. I apologize for the heavy breathing and sniffling. I have really bad allergies, and it's allergy season right now. So this is just me assembling the clay and adding some of the little 
cute little charms and whenever i play with this i do recommend taking out the charms since they are very like big charms and it could hurt your hand or just be like in the way while playing with this and this was also very nice and very clicky i loved the end texture this is one of my favorite slimes um comment down below your favorite slime from this pack and it was very clicky and i love mixing it in it was very easy to mix in and it had i loved while mixing it i could see the pink and the colors the, the different colors all throughout the slime and this is one of my favorite peachy babies has the best ices thick and glossies and clay slimes i personally love their clays That's just my cat and also enjoying the slime. Next we have Teddy Bear Grahams. This one smells just like those nostalgic teddy bear biscuits I used to eat with my friends. I remember we would go around the neighborhood and then we would eat the these while playing hopscotch. It came with some cute little females and charms and the cutest honeypot charm. That it was so cute. I decided to take off his ear. Well my brother just I told him to take off his ear. Um <laughs> Oh my gosh, he was being so vicious with it. This clay did come a little dried up, which is totally fine. I did let this slime sit for a little while. Um but it was a, I'm pretty sure it was a Cloudo and Jelly Hybrid. It still, it makes bubble pops, but very, like, kind of a little bit of bubble pops. If you do like, like, textures of cloud dough but you like bubble pops then this is the slime for you i always carry around this small little sample of this slime with me so i can just take the slime wherever i go bye guys